Hi Sagittarius, welcome to your daily love reading. My name is Pretty, and I'll be doing your love reading today. So before we begin with your love reading Sagittarius, please do remember to take what resonates and to leave behind whatever does not. Okay, so let's begin with your love reading Sagittarius. Okay, so at the bottom of the deck, we have the Judgment card, and this is Scorpio energy. So this is an energy of truth. This is an energy of clarity, you receiving answers, someone is giving you their truth. With this card, there's also an energy of a second chance or a rebirth. Um, something could be coming back around. Someone could be coming back around and wanting to have a new beginning with you or wanting to restart a connection with you. There's that heavy energy of a rebirth, and this person who wants to have restore a connection with you there is an energy of change here like almost like they've changed in some way for the better or they've transformed so they're the kind of relationship they would be offering you this time around is quite different from what they had with you in the past there is a heavy energy of transformation ev evolution and second chances here so let's see <clears throat> we have the eight of swords in the reverse air energy the knights of swords air energy and the ace of swords air energy yeah, it really looks like there's someone here who's not wanting to lose you. They're afraid of losing you. And with the Knight of Swords, they feel like they have to take action towards you quite quickly. This person has a lot they want to say to you. And this is someone who's fighting to keep you, fighting to prevent you from leaving their life. This is someone who wants a breakthrough with you. It really looks like there's some sort of truth that they want to express to you because you also have the Ace of Swords. This could be someone who held back a lot when they were with you and they regret holding back because now it's like the floodgates have been opened. They're going to just say everything. They want to get something off their chest. They feel they feel free to speak up, you know, and this is someone who's making it be known to you that they don't want you to get away from them. They don't want you to leave. With the Ace of Swords, they are the ones who are initiating contact here. This is someone who's going to be giving you clarity, mental clarity. Let's clarify these cards, Sagittarius. we have the six of pentacles and this is earth energy Vir <clears throat> virgo taurus capricorn energy so this is an energy of someone who wants to be generous towards you this person wants to make something up to you or they want to make up with you uh, this is someone who sees you as a very positive influence in their life they see you as a kind soul and someone they want a relationship with let's see what the rest of the cards have to say we have the tower, Mars energy, the five of wands, fire energy, and the nine of swords in the reverse air energy. Yeah, you could have had an abrupt breakup or ending with this person because it's like it's only starting to hit them now that they, they're losing you or they lost you. And they're not handling, they're not taking this well, like it's really affecting them. It does look like this is someone who you had a conflict with and you may have actually removed your energy from them, like you could have distanced yourself and your absence is actually really being felt by this person like they they have been suffering without you this is someone who like they were quite shocked here almost like they never expected you to leave them or to walk away um and you know this tower moment was a wake-up call for this person and with the nine of swords here in the reverse there's an energy of them having had been suffering in silence but because it's in the reverse we're seeing someone who no longer wants to do that in silence. Like they, they're they ready to make it known to you that they want you. They, they're ready to make it known that their life doesn't feel good without you. You know, like they're going to be more honest, more open and expressive. They want to talk to you. They don't want to hide their feelings or their anxieties. Like this is someone who wants to open up to you. Okay, so I'm going to pull out an oracle card for you, Sagittarius. Okay, 
okay we have step out of your comfort zone north node so yeah this person is going to chase you this person is like this may be kind of out of character for this person but this is someone who you know they've been shocked by your departure um it may not even be your departure it may just be how negatively your absence has affected them it's it's quite shocking to them like this is someone who really doesn't want to lose you okay so let's see Okay, we have getting to know each other as you reveal your innermost selves to each other your bond deepens yeah this is someone who's no longer going to suffer in silence this is someone who wants to let you in you know this is someone who's going to be vulnerable with you they are going to let you know how they feel you know this is someone who wants you to know their, their deeper feelings what's going on within right now um this is someone who's no longer going to be stoic okay so let's see we have rebirth and new beginnings new beginnings are often disguised as painful endings yeah this is someone who the, your departure or the ending that they had with you is very painful and they are set to try to have a new beginning with you like this is someone who is really wanting a rebirth between you guys they want this connection back and with this card there's also an energy that this is someone who sees your value like they see your worth they they see you are someone who you know deserves the world you know and they want to treat you better this is someone who wants to do whatever it takes to maintain their relationship with you to keep you not just for now but like to maintain a long-term relationship because even with the north node this is future oriented energy like this person feels like you're part of their destiny you could be the one that they should fight for you okay so i'm gonna pull out a card for your advice sagittarius Okay, we have surrender comparisons with other people keep your eyes trained on yourself focus on your own strengths attractiveness and power okay so that's what i'm seeing for you sagittarius i hope you have a really really good day sagittarius bye sagittarius